your one stop shouldn't be your last so make sure you subscribe like share hey darling welcome back to my channel so today we're doing what's my hospital bag this video is long overdue because guys currently we are at let me it's not very well we are at 38 it's gone so yeah we are heavy and yeah so what's my hospital bag this baby's bag is my box and has some baby things in it the hospital gave us a list to work with but there are more things luckily for me my hospital in nigeria here don't ask for hand glove surgical glove um, delivery mat and the rest of them let me just go read through the list before i show you everything i have in my bag the list has mother and also has baby for mothers they say they want photo wrappers <laughs> toiletries comfort pad six i don't know that isn't six for mosha is for you it's for you so if it's remaining you carry your mumbo and go home bedroom slippers nightgown two free ones bulletin bag mother's dress shaving stick two toothpaste and brush disposable pants bathing soap cream milton two big tissue then two well for the both of you olive oil that's i'm entering baby's own now olive oil soap and baby oil gel pampas baby wear the roof for but your girl carried more than four <laughs> net shawl baby cap and socks hot water flats comb cutting wool cup and spoon periods baby wipes so these are the things that are here in fact in the mother's list they omitted to well and breast pad and the rest of them so i think june and they're talking about it <clears throat> and we added it to the list provision and the rest of them so guys let me show you what's in my hospital bag i've read the list to you guys so this baby's bag in this bag i packed i see we are going on the vacation <laughs> so we have clothes here for newborn three zero to three months i also have from maybe to six months yeah so i packed everything in this bag so this one is what the other what do you call this this is newborn let me just show you guys so so cute it's small this came in a set with, with a beep too but i didn't carry the beep or did i yeah this is so cute was a gift for baby too during my baby shower so i just carried carry almost all the newborns i got all the newborn item i got packed everything so this is newborn this is inna i think no this is not inna this is also newborn yeah see so read me a bedtime story they're so cute these clothes are so cute yeah so we have newborn then this is overall is it or is it sleep sleep suit they call it yeah sleep suit i don't want to this thing too much because i don't have strength to arrange it too much i'm sure you one more yeah this one too i think it's a sleep suit too so cute mm. so actually put this one so let me just bring out the rest of them this also is sleep suit People ask what I'm packing for. I'm not packing just in case it's normal delivery or CS. I don't want to can't be bothered when I get to the hospital. We figure that out. So we also have sleep suits here. We have more. Three, three months. That's this part of the outside noise. Then we have more clothes here. Like I mentioned earlier, what I was why I packed all these clothes. Clothes. So all these are baby's clothes. Yeah, I carry two flannel. I carry baby towel. I carry small one. The small one, the big one is at home. I didn't buy those three in one towel just because I did not like the texture I was feeling in it. I mean, the texture that was when, I, when the woman that was sending baby thing gave us, I'm like, nah, I don't want. I want no more towel, so I bought no more towel for baby. So I can absorb. So no need buying those ones. Then we have these two cute shawl, this one and this blue one. Then in here I have lots of pampas. I took 20 pampas. 
that's just because I bought the big one and I cannot carry that big one to the hospital. If we need more, my husband will bring for us, but I don't think we'll be needing more. This 20 should be enough, and even over enough, sir. In here, I was okay. I packed the bib that came with that first clip I showed you guys. This is the bib. I carried extra bib. Just in case, wash clothes. I took about four wash clothes. Then, maybe scarf. I took four. Then we have, in here we have socks and meal things. Meetings, meetings, yeah, for baby. See, yeah, so, so, so cute. Yeah, I took three meetings, then I took like four socks. I know I'll not be needing all these things, but yeah. Then by the side of baby's bag, I have this Milton. It's leaking, that's why I'll put this thing on it. So sterilizing, by the way. They don't use they don't use feeder in the hospital where I'm going to put to bed. So there's no need to carry feeder, you just carry cup and spoon. So we don't sterilize it, we just want to sterilize it. That's in case I'm not producing breast milk. By the side of baby's bag, I have um what do I have here again? I have baby wipes. Yep. But I think the light is changing. So this is what we have for baby. Maybe it's toiletries inside this box with the box. So let me take this one out, then I'll show you what we have in the box. So guys, for this box, in here I have disposable pants. I have um breast pad. Let me show you guys. This disposable pant then I bought a pack of it. Comes a pack of ten. Yeah, I think I bought about eighteen thousand. Comes pack a pack of ten, and it's three XL. So that I will not need to use this. Because I don't think I have time to wash. I also have enough breast pad here. This breast pad, I don't know if I'm going to lactate it immediately, but just in case I'm going to, I don't want stain everywhere. If that makes sense, like I told you guys, I packed it. You no, know, I packed everything I would need. I don't want anybody to start running home because I kept. I don't want any, when anybody come back home, they're coming from the hospital. Why did they keep some? Why did they keep that one? Everything is my bag with me in the hospital. Then over here I have clothes for myself. 90s is on my 90s. 90s. I think I took about, about three nineties. Nineties. Then I have towel for myself. I carry the small towel for myself. I didn't carry a big one. I'm praying with my finger crossed. I don't spend more than one night in the hospital. So then I have nothing bra. A normal bra, but bigger regular bra than the one I have at home. So normal bra, regular bra. And this is also ninety. Let me first keep this one. <coughs> then here I have outfits. Either of these two will be going on my outfit. I'll carry the two of them just in case. Then I have the conflict pad. We have six here. They said they wanted six, so. In here, I have six. The big tissue that they ask for. I could just run the floor. The big tissue that they ask for is in here too. So I don't start this thing. This is the big cup. I've not opened it. They have me. Is it me? Me, 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 I have four wrappers. Just bought, just carry two wrappers at home and cut it to two, 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 three, three yards. Four. Wrapper is big. <laughs> but I don't think to wear a pack for delivery. I know that it may force me. I have my own this here. My own this. More on this. That in case I need it to wear. Yeah, maybe a spoon. But I don't know I'm carrying this cutting board to the hospital. Since I don't know I'm carrying it. I think I'll probably have, I'll just carry it in case we need it. This is the net, the cut net for the hospital. Bedroom slippers. Then in here I have baby toiletries. Let me open it for you guys. This is the gel that they're using for the umbilical cord. Then I bought baby secrets. 
So they want just oil and soap. That I'm carrying. I don't want to carry liquid soap. I have the lotion at home. I'm also I'm not carrying it too because according to them, maybe it's react to lotion sometimes. So they want to still like to start with oil. And they even advise that if you're going to even use the lotion, wait until the baby is like three months so that you understand if the baby is going to react to it. So we're going with the oil. And this oil, put me I will use too because I also use oil at home. That's not only carrying to baby oil to the hospital, if that makes sense. Then we have thermometer here. I don't know if I'll need it, I just carried it. We have baby um, comb. This comb is from the grooming kit I bought. This one too. The newborn baby, so you know, I have bought a set of comb, that's very funny. For when the baby has passed now, I bought it now. The only thing that came with the grooming kit was not good, so I had to go and buy a new one. But this one, I think for five, four, eight, that be. Then they asked for purity in the hospital, so I carry the small one. I have a bigger one at home here. Then Vaseline. Guys, fun fact there, I bought Vaseline. I just bought it because I actually I was still buying Vaseline. I also bought solo cream, so people use any one, people use everything. So this is where it has the toiletries. Guys, pardon me what I'm doing, I'm packing up. So, <laughs> Ew. This girl cannot do this one. Go to do enter. So we have Goya oil. They asked for one. I was carrying so just in case. This is what they're using cleaning baby after baby is born. They don't bathe baby immediately. They do, I think they do 24 hours after baby is born before they um, shower the baby. So when baby is born, they clean baby up very well. If one is not enough, I have extra. It's my baby. So in here i have my own toiletries so body spray body spray is kind of very mild she will still be asked for toothpaste roll on baking soap i also have these gloves yeah so everything is going in here it's long i don't mind up to this the gloves, everything is going in here. Then lift lip tone, lip tone, tone lifting. <laughs> lip tone. This is just in case I'm having a CS. This is the first thing you're going to drink. Yeah. Just to check if your bowel movement is going on well. Carry this already. Then in here I have golden more. Just carry five. I have a roll of milk, thick milk, I have a roll of milk. Like I said, just in case. If I don't need I'm mean, still my own. Then we have um polythene bag. They have, they have the actual actual bag. This one is for, for us that are people they say this one is for um I'm not looking here. Omega cord, yeah, omega cord. No omega cord though. Ah, placenta. They don't ask for you need just maybe one or two. I bought four. 100 naira, it's not so much. Then this black waterproof, that's small, small ones, 300. This is for you actually, for the mother. When you're changing your palm, um, your pad, sorry, you don't treasure the bin like that, it tight, like everywhere. We clean. But they explain to us why we need this. So that's what is here. Basically, I think the only thing that I, I didn't show you guys here is what that flax is inside, then detergent. Just in case, the only thing not for detergent, I can I already at least to you guys earlier. They didn't ask for detergent at all. So just in case I need it, I'm going to use it, buy it, and keep it in my bag. Anything I don't use from my this um I think basically all those cord clamp, all those things just to provide cord clamp. I watched what mouse tool is I saw people buying um kinomai um gloves, different sizes of gloves, hand gloves, down and down. All those things, my husband is going to provide all those things. So basically, this is what I will need, and it's what baby will need. So, thank you for watching. If you watch up until now, thank you very much. <sighs> tired, <laughs> I'm tired. The first video I did, I caught, I, I, I threw that one away, but this one will make it to the streets. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm going to this year for three hours straight because you're my love. You're my bestie. You don't know. That being said, 
I'll catch you lovelies in my next video. Love and light, bye. Mwah. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answered a no, man, I still go.